What's going on, Monster Jam fans? And welcome back to Scissor TV. You could be anywhere in the world right now, but you're hanging out with us, and I thank you for that. If you want to see some amazing Monster Jam crashing, smashing, freestyling action, you, my friend, have come to the right place. But enough talking. Let's get into the action. So let's get ready to monster! And here we go with race number one following Grave Digger Fire. Oh, and they are off! It looks like we've got Megalodon, Soldier of Fortune, two El Toro Locos, and Alien Invasion in this quick runoff. It's gonna be a short but brutal race for our Monster Jam trucks. Megalodon is just trying to inch right in front of Grave Digger Fire and Alien Invasion bringing up the back, but Grave Digger Fire is getting those sweet jumps in, maintaining his speed and catching up to El Toro Loco. Oh, and there we go, guys. That is the end of race number one in our Fire vs. Ice Challenge. Our second race, we're going to be following Ice, El Toro Loco, on a mud-filled circuit track. And here they go. Oh, and El Toro Loco Ice not wasting any time and blowing some smoke and showing that he means business. He's angry and he wants the win. It is a tight race and you can see in these turns might be what makes or breaks it for each one of our Monster Jam trucks. You have an opportunity if you can cut that turn a little tight to just inch out ahead of your competition. And El Toro Loco Ice looks like he's trying to do that right now. Oh, look at that jump. All the Monster Jam trucks and Dalmatian Monster Mutt just came soaring over El Toro Loco Ice. I think he actually made contact and rolled off the track. Blue Thunder is right on the tail of El Toro Loco Ice. Oh, coming into another turn. Can he close the distance with Alien Invasion? And it doesn't seem that he can. Oh, and Blue Thunder goes right in front of El Toro Loco Ice. Oh, Max D is also starting to come up on him. This is going to be a photo finish as they're coming into the last stretch of this only lap. Oh, and El Toro Loco Ice has finished. That is event number two in the books as we're going to be taking it to the team fire for Max D as he does a freestyle competition. Big jump right off the start. Picking up some speed and lining up his next trick. Oh, look at that, a backflip. Lands it beautifully and the crowd is going wild. Some more big air right over the middle. Oh, into a stoppy. Oh, right into another wheelie. Some more air off one of the smaller ramps. Oh, and a whirlwind tornado. And he absolutely sticks the landing. Oh, loses a bit of the truck, but is able to maintain and get back on all four of those big old BKT tires. A front flip over the middle. Oh, tries to land a sideways back flip, but doesn't get it. Can he get back up? Yes, he can. I'm dizzy just watching that. Oh, some more sideways air into a wheelie, flips it and lands. That's amazing. Oh, you can see that Max D Fire is willing to leave it all out on the course tonight for us. Some more giant air over the middle. Oh, into a stoppy. Looks like he's gonna pick up some speed. Oh, doing some 360s into a wheelie and almost landed the cartwheel, but able to get back on all four tires. 
Oh, some big air into a two-wheel landing, a sideways split cartwheel. Oh, and I think Max D, he's not done yet. He's still going. Wow, that is one of the greatest performances I think I've ever seen in a freestyle. That's going to be a hard act to follow, but Monster Mutt Dalmatian Ice is going to hit another circuit race, and here they go. He's heading up against Earthshaker, Pirate's Curse. I think that's another one of his buddies, Monster Mutt Rottweiler. And oh, he's falling to the back right off the bat. Hopefully he can make up some time. And oh, he does with some big air getting back into the middle of the pack, catching up with Gravedigger the Legend. But it looks like we've got Soldier of Fortune in first place right now. Oh, if only Dalmatian Ice can build up some speed here. Here we go. All right, he's starting to pass. He's going to show who the top dog in this race is, and it is definitely Monster Mutt Dalmatian Ice starting to gain on Pirate's Curse. Hopefully he can get some bigger off of these ramps. Oh, but nobody is giving an inch in this race. Earthshaker coming out of nowhere to go in front of Dalmatian Ice. The lead has changed so many times during this race, I think it's impossible to know who's going to finish in first place. But one thing I do know is that every single monster truck is giving it 100% in this race and leaving it all out on that dirt track. We're building up some really good speed in the jumps, and right now, yes, he's taking that corner nice and tight. He's able to get in front of him. Oh, but Earthshaker pulls out again. Monster Mutt is not giving up either. He is constantly on Dalmatian's tail, and there he goes pulling ahead of him right there. We're coming up to the last turn. This is the final lap, guys. Who is going to finish? How is Monster Mutt Dalmatian going to do? Some big air to finish strong. Can he get there? And yes, Monster Mutt Dalmatian Ice finishes the race strong and looks good. All right, we're going back to Team Fire. It's going to be a short sprint, and we've got Megalodon Fire. Oh, off they go. A late start by Megalodon Fire, but hopefully he can catch up to the Monster Jam truck pack. We've got Soldier of Fortune, Gravedigger the Legend, Earthshaker, and a whole bunch of others. And you can tell that Megalodon Fire is hungry for this win. Oh, he's trying to soar right over the other Monster Jam trucks, and he's not letting up off that gas. Oh, Northern Nightmare tries to get ahead right at the end, but he's unable. Megalodon Fire finishes strong. All right, guys, it looks like we have another freestyle competition. We're taking it to Soldier of Fortune Ice, and let's see what he's got. Big air into a backflip, strong start for Soldier of Fortune Ice into a wheelie over the trucks in the center of the ramp. Big air in the middle, everybody loves to see that he had to have been at least 20 or 30 feet above it. Oh, a front flip over the center embankment into two wheels going in and doing some amazing donuts right there. I'm getting dizzy just watching, guys. All right, he's lining up for his next trick. Some giant air over the middle. Oh my goodness, he must have cut over half the course right there. Some sideways air as he turns around and does a 180. Showing us how well he's able to use the mud to get around the arena. Getting some mid-air right there. I think he's building up speed. Oh, and another front flip right over there. Those front flips are so difficult to pull off. Into a tornado wheelie over the center into a backward stoppy. Look at him maintaining his balance. This is a clinic that Soldier of Fortune Ice is putting on for us. 
Some more big air lands sideways on two wheels, keeps going. Thank goodness all those massive BKT tires. Oh my goodness, straight up into the box and he lands a backflip. Oh, 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 losing half the truck in the process, but he's not gonna be slowed down. Another huge backflip right into the center, into two wheels. Soldier of Fortune put it all out on the line for us tonight. That was amazing. All right, guys, I don't know about you, but I thought that was an epic fire versus ice showdown. I tell you what, I'm going to need your help so that we can determine who won. So I need you to comment down below and tell me which team you think won, fire or ice. It's completely up to you guys, so I can't wait to hear what you think. Thanks for watching and do me a favor before you leave, make sure you're subscribed to the channel, hit that like button, and until next week, we'll see ya!